Happening this morning, a rare annular solar eclipse called a ring of fire solar eclipse that unfortunately we're not seeing out of our own backyard. But this is a live picture from NASA this morning. How cool is that? If you've got a minute, Grant will explain what it is and who's able to see it right now. All right, so a solar eclipse is when the moon moves over the front of the sun. Now, in the case of this ring of fire eclipse, the moon won't completely cover the disk of the sun, and that's why it's called an annular or an annulus or a ring shaped object. Now, a total solar eclipse is when the moon completely covers the sun, except for that elusive corona. Now, the reason this happens is because of the fact that the orbit of the moon around the Earth is not a perfect circle. It's actually actually an ellipse creating times where the moon is closer to the earth and times where it's farther away when it's closer. That's when it creates that total lunar eclipse. But in the case of what's happening this morning, we are seeing that annular solar eclipse where the moon is farther away from the earth, making it appear smaller in the sky. And that's why it's not able to completely cover the face of the sun. Unfortunately, the total part of the eclipse is going to be occurring in Canada shooting across the North Pole, but there will still be places across the Northeast, Mid-Atlantic and Upper Midwest that will be able to see the partial eclipse.